U.S. top military commander in Latin America now sounding the alarm on China's growing influence in the region, saying we need to act now. Fox News' Jennifer Griffin, this is quite a stunning report that Jennifer has. She's live at the Pentagon with the story. Jennifer. Liz, General Laura Richardson, the head of U.S. Southern Command, says of the 31 countries she's responsible for in Latin America, 21 have now signed up for China's Belt and Road Initiative, buying up deep-sea ports, rare earth minerals, and a new Chinese military-run space station in Argentina that China could use to blind the U.S. in a future conflict. Then there's the Panama Canal, through which half the shipping containers from Asia pass each year to get to the east east coast of the United States. The Chinese are gobbling up real estate on either end of the canal, 47 bilateral agreements since 2017. The U.S. has not had an ambassador assigned to Panama for five years. Fifty U.S. ambassadors are still waiting to be confirmed by the Senate. Chile, three years without an ambassador. Brazil, three years without an ambassador. When countries see that we don't have our senior diplomat there, it shows that we're not serious. That's the message that it sends. And then they, they, don't, really, they don't really do anything of substance with the United States when we don't have our senior diplomat there. It's Eighty percent of Mexico's telecommunications are now controlled by China. Chinese companies now have a monopoly in the lithium triangle, according to General Richardson. Argentina, Bolivia and Chile, where two-thirds of the world's lithium reserves needed for electric batteries are mined. Today, 200 years after, we are at a point in which the U.S. has the lowest level of influence in the region as compared to the, two, to the past 200 years. And recently, Honduras and oil-rich Guyana shocked the U.S. by agreeing to renounce ties with Taiwan under pressure from Beijing. Liz? Incredible journalism. Jennifer Griffin, that was quite a story. Thank you so much for bringing it to